everything was. <laughs> you're not. Hey, you're not. We can do this. <sighs> Come on. Where to next? Can't stay here. I don't know, Jonah! <laughs> what was that clue? Uh, the heart of the serpent, something. The heart of the serpent is in the cup near the many stone faces. And what kind of cup are we talking about? Some kind of chalice? A chalice that's not very mine. <laughs> It's not mine. The clue was left by a 17th century missionary, Andrea Lopez, a Jesuit. The serpent in the chalice is a symbol of St. John. We're looking for a Christian holy site. Like a church of San Juan? That's a pretty common name. Could be dozens. Not within trekking distance from Paititi. Come on, the road is this way. We'll get out of here and talk to some people. Okay. What would I do without you? Split up. I'll look for signs of Lopez. We'll ask around, see what we can find out. My friend Sara's an archaeologist. She works near here. Want to go see if she knows anything about your riddle? That would be great. The stone faces have always been Sara's obsession. Most people come here looking for treasure, but not Sara. She just wants answers. Have you been friends a long time? Since we were kids. She was the no Abby, can you help me with this? It's broken. Hold on. Are you that Lara? Croft? I am. I recognize you from your picture. What's your interest with this place? I'm following a riddle. The heart of the serpent is in the cup near the many stone faces. The stone faces? That's why I'm here too. I don't want to step on your toes. It's the serpent in the cup I'm really looking for. Well, I can tell you the faces have been here for at least 400 years. According to documents in the library, they keep watch. Legend has it, they're guarding a secret crypt. A crypt? We've never been able to find it. As you can imagine, that's what drives the treasure hunters crazy. But if the infamous Lara Croft is as clever as they say she is, well, if you were to find it, you might be doing me a favor. You think I should start at the library? Yes, it's over by the cemetery. It's one of the oldest buildings here. Make sure you credit me if you find anything. Thank you, I will. Laura, you find anything yet? Abby's friend mentioned a crypt somewhere around the library. I'll meet you there. Gracias por darme la fortaleza para superar mi creación. So there's a crypt around here somewhere? 
a secret crypt. Why secret? If Lopez is involved, there's bound to be a trick. That's a solid theory. What about you? Did you find anything? I got a pamphlet. Seven steps closer to God. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it'll help. like a mausoleum. Mm, means we're on the right track, right? Jonah, I feel something. We're getting close. Let's look around for signs of Lopez. These notes were written by the founder of the second A heron and an eclipse. They're talking about funds allocated for renovations to the library. His wings, you may seek refuge. Under his wings. is from the 17th century. This book describes a stranger's arrival at the mission. He founded the Sect of Seven. Maybe that was Lopez. Like on the pamphlet. We must be getting close. We should keep looking. darkened and the moon will not give its light. Jonah, those two Bible quotes, the sun will be darkened and under his wings you may seek refuge. What does it mean? That's it. Look for a heron and an eclipse.
There's a whole mural under here. Jesus takes up the cross. These are the stations of the cross. But there's a bunch missing. Before 1600, there were only seven. This could date back to the time of Lopez. This is one of his clues. Yeah, it's the kind of thing he does. All right. Let's see if we can find a cross lying around here somewhere. When we find the box, how do we get the key back from Dominguez? We'll find a way. Densley is young to have all that responsibility. It must be pretty hard for him. I can only imagine. Reforzamos todo lo que pedimos. Found something? Yeah. Jesus takes up the cross. Help me lift this. Long way down. Let's see where this leads. Jesus pulls the first time. 